Hi everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are going to discuss about the model inheritance in Odoo 17. So mainly there are three types of uh, model inheritance that is the classic, the traditional and the delegation. So here you can see that I have developed a custom module called company management. And let me go to the backend. And when I go to the backend here in the Python page, I have just given a class here that is custom class and I have given the model here so i have inherited the model sale.order.line so here what i'm actually trying to do is that i'm trying to give a custom field inside the model sale.order.line so i've inherited the model sale.order.line and here I'm, I'm trying to give a custom field inside the uh, already existing model that is the sale.order.line and if you just Select this and if you just globally search, you can see multiple examples regarding the regarding how do you can just inherit the model. You can see multiple examples here and after you specify the model that is the model to be inherited and the custom field that you want to be inherited in the, inside the model sale.order.line you can just specify it in the view. So here I have given the view here, I have specified the model sale.order and here I've given the external ID of the view in which I want to display this field and I've also given a widget called boolean toggle so I want to display it as a toggle button and after that let me run the code from here and make sure you give the view in the manifest file of your custom module that you've created so uh, let me go to the UI and let me upgrade the module from here so after upgrading the module from here, let me go to the sales and in the, so this is the view in which I have just uh, inherited the field, the custom field. And you can see that you have given the field here. You have, uh, you can see the field here. And if you just click on this, you can see that it is a toggle button because we have given the widget as toggle button. And now let me go to the backend that is the PyCharm and show you an example of the delegation inheritance. In delegation inheritance, the attributes used are underscore inherits. The basic purpose of this inheritance is to sync other models into our custom module without waiting the view. The field in our model and also the field from the inherited module will be present in the database. Here we get the complete view of the inherited module. So I'll be showing you an example uh, by globally searching the keyword inherits so i have searched for the uh, keyword inherits and you can see here the file mask i have given the file mask as python page and you can see multiple examples regarding the same so i'll be choosing one of the example and here you can see in this python file uh, this the model is the uh, account.payment and in the inherits you can see that the account.mo has been inherited here uh, with the keyword inherits. So this means that it is an example of the delegation inheritance. So yeah, after doing this, you will be getting the access to all the fields that is present in account.mo. And here also you have defined a field called move ID. So I'll just search for this field inside this Python file and you can see that there's a field here which I have defined uh, already, which has been defined already. And you can see the field here. So this field can help you to give you the values of the records that has been created. That is the ID that has been of the records that has been created in the account.move in account.payment. So you will be getting easy access to the uh, record ID that has been created in the account.move as you have done a delegation inheritance here in your model account.payment and as you have done the delegation inheritance you can also uh, fetch the view of the account.mo by inheriting view of account.mo in account.payment so this is a basic example of the delegation inheritance in Odoo 17 that's all for today thank you